Okay, now that you got the Avid Marquee title tool fired up, we're going to go into the basic animation mode and we're going to create a rolling credit. And rolling credit, it, it's not really the best thing that you can do with Avid Marquee. I would rather do mine in, in After Effects and import it in, but just to show you the option that you can do it. And the thing is, is that it has to be in a plain text format like other things that we've imported. And it has basically limitations in a plain text format. But we're going to look at doing a simple um, roll because that's an important thing to know. So basically what we need to do is uh, come down and let's make sure that we have uh, a layer and a scene here and we don't need to see the background because we're going to be on black anyway because it's going to be at the end and what we're going to do is click on the roll adjust roll and that's going to create this um, marching ants thing and it's going to tell you show you the directionality and everything and uh, basically we're not going to change this because we want it to to work the way that you know rolling credit should so that now that we've got this we need to enter the text tool and enter text there and this red um, scroll bar will appear and then we can import our file so then we go to file import and we're going to import our plain text file that we have so we're going to go over to that and it's called credits and you can see it has the basic stuff we'll open it and then it populates it, it shows us the rolling bar and that's fantastic if we want to change anything like I want mine to all be in, down the middle click in there so you selected it and then go up and align center and if you wanted to change your text you could click in there and hit um, your command A and select everything and then you could go and choose a whole different font if you want so basically that's it that's how we do it and when you're done with that just like anything else you go to file and save to bin and we're gonna type in end credits and we're gonna hit OK and we'll make sure that we're going to our title our titles bin and we'll hit end credits perfect we'll hit save and uh, I'm going to hit the S key and make sure I'm at the very end of my project. Yes, I am. Perfect. Let's look at these rolling credits. It's going to be black because it's going to roll in. So perfect. That's the way it should be. Let's place that in. All right. So this is a, has an RT on it for the rolling title. And, you know, if we hit the T key, we can see that this thing is a minute and 29 seconds long, which is slower than molasses for what we want to do. So what we're going to do is lasso the end of this, and we're going to bring it back. And now it's, you know, 12 seconds. So what we need to do is render this. And let's take a look now. Great, so I'm totally happy with that speed. I can read everything, and that's it. If we need to uh, make any adjustments, we can lasso it again, and we can stretch it out. So that's it. Now you know how to do a uh, basic rolling title.